All right, good morning everybody. So I had a few minutes this morning and I found an outlet and a little bit of wire. Um, so I wanted to show you guys what a hot and neutral reversal looks like behind the wall and how to fix it. Um, this is not at all, you know, how to, if you're not comfortable working with electrical anything, then hire an electrician. Please don't shock yourself. So what you'll see in the report is you'll see a picture of this plugged into an outlet and you'll have these two lights lit up, your amber and your center orange light lit up, indicating that you have a hot and neutral reversal. So what that looks like at the outlet is once you pull this out of the wall, you'll see a bare copper wire, which is your ground, a white wire, which is your neutral, and a black wire, which is your hot. So when we're talking about a hot and neutral reversal, we're talking about these two wires only. And what it means is exactly what it sounds like. These wires are on the opposite side of, of the, the outlet. So the fix for that is just as simple. All you're doing is you're taking the hot and the neutral and switching them to the correct side of the outlet. So the neutral side of the outlet is usually indicated um, by it either is on the same side as, as your ground wire or you'll see that the screws are uh, more silver um, or you know just a brighter color than the other side. So then you look at the other side, you see these, these screws are gold. Um, they're a little darker, indicating that that's the hot side of your outlet. So that's just a quick way to, to kind of determine you know what side it is. But if it's brought up and they're, it's saying that they're reversed, then typically all you're going to do is just switch them. Um, and that will that'll give you the correct polarity at that outlet. So anyways, that's that's it. Uh, quick, easy, and simple. Nothing, nothing to be too worried about. Again, if you're not comfortable working with uh, anything electrical, then I would highly recommend hiring you know a competent handyman or um, an electrician. So anyways, guys, uh, I appreciate everything you guys do, and you guys have a great weekend. Thanks.